Hi guys, would you like to see what the picture quality is like on a sub £60 projector? Stick with me because the full review is coming up right after this. Hi guys, so after a really busy couple of weeks at my business, yes, I do have my own business. This does not pay the bills in any way, shape or form. It's just a hobby I have. I have found, well, got a projector off one of these sites that offers coupons for £10. Now this projector, I'm actually quite shocked with. It's only a mini projector. It's got LED source. It can link up your fire stick hdmi you can do it from your ipad your iphone and many other sources you can input it like hdmi cables straight into the back i use it on the white wall behind me and it was like a home cinema system when i hooked it up to a beat run 10 pound speaker that i got sent to me to review a while back so what i'm going to do is i'm going to show you how I set it up and then I'm going to show you what it looked like when I was recording it and you tell me if you think this was worth £10. Now on Amazon depending where you go it goes all the way from £35.99 to £68.99 and it's the exact same projector just under a different name and this happens all the time like people get like a product and they slap their name on it, but it's exactly the same product with the same spec. You can go on other YouTube channels and see this same projector getting reviewed under a totally different name. And it's exactly the same spec of projector. So don't think just because something's more expensive that it's better because it's not. This one, I think it was retailing at $35.99. And I'll show you the page, which is currently unavailable at the moment. But I got it for £10 on a review site, which I'm going to do a video on because when you see the amount of stuff I've been able to get for absolutely, some, some of it's for absolute nothing, not a penny, some of it's for 9p, believe it or not, and some things that cost £40 for around £5 and £2 and things like that. And I'm going to do a video on that and show you about that. But today I'm just going to show you what this projector is like how it works, how I set it up, and if you think it's as good as what I thought it was, because I watched about three videos on the night now, um, thinking it was awesome. So let's get cracking, and I'll show you all about it and what it can actually do, and how I set it up. Let's have a look. This is the actual projector here, and I'll show you the setup and where it is. So this here now you can see is the actual projector on a cheap tripod set up in my office room. The one that I use for my actual business that I do every day. Now I hooked up a HDMI cable straight from my Apple TV which was excellent and an old cable to a little speaker here which was brilliant sound to be truthful and we used it against that wall on the back so that was the setup and for 10 pound i'm going to show you now actual video footage of what it was actually like so this is the actual and it comes off the front comes off there so there's the optical lens you focus it from underneath here and that shows you how it goes in and out, so that's how you get your focus. And when you want to straighten it up, there's a little button under here. Like a roll, I think. And that helps you to basically get it nice and straight on the wall. So that's what I used. And we use it on that wall. And there's the remote that you get to go with the projector.
kind of wild. Right, guys, there you have it. You've seen it on the wall. Now, I did film that in the dark on my iPhone 8 Plus, so it's not as good as what I was watching, but I think it still shows you what quality you got for less than £60. Now, that one, that projector was £35.99, but the exact same projectors, and I mean exactly the same, are going for £60 just under a different name. Same spec, same look, exactly the same just under a different name now this happens all the time so you've got to understand that just because it's more expensive doesn't mean it's better so i'm going to be doing a full review on how i managed to get that for 10 pounds and you were literally going to be surprised how you can get things products for literally zero because i've got so much kit here to review and so much kit coming tomorrow i think i've got about 10 items coming tomorrow alone and I think it's somewhere around about £600 I've got worth of kit coming, which I've spent £100 getting. Now, that might seem a lot to use, but I also sell stuff that I buy at auctions, and it's just a little bit of profit that I made off the stuff that I've sold at auctions. So, if you want to see how you can get stuff for your review channel for £2, or literally 0 or 99% off the actual sale price, and I'll show you all the stuff that I have had and I've had delivered. I'll show you all on my Amazon account, how much I paid for it and how much it was selling for. And some of these products have got 150 reviews, near enough five star. Some of them are five star. If you want to see that video, then press the bell button. If you like this video, give it a big thumbs up. And if you want to subscribe, then please press the subscribe button. Now, until next time, guys, if you've got any questions, then leave it in the comment section and I will answer each and every one of them. But until then, I'll see you later, guys, and take care out there. My name's Craig. This is Gadget King Reviews.